Hello, Joe here from Infinity of Tacoma. Today I'm going to tell you about this beautiful 2017 Jaguar XF. Uh, this is the Prestige trim. The Prestige is one of the range topping trim levels on the Jaguar. You have the uh, base, the premium, and then the Prestige. The Prestige has lots of nice standard features, including a beautiful leather interior. Uh, all the other ones, I, the lower ones, come standard with leatherette. Uh, leather might be optional on some packages, uh, but this beautiful leather interior is standard in the Prestige and it feels wonderful. Uh, great sounding Meridian audio system, uh, black piano finish. And one cool thing about this Jaguar, usually I start my videos with the vehicles already running, but one of the cool things is what this vehicle does when you start it. So this is the rotary gear selector. So when you start it, the gear selector pops up and then the vents for the climate control also open. Obviously there's really no purpose to it, but it's a luxury vehicle, so it adds just a, like a smidge of elegance to the vehicle. Uh, but the rotary gear selector is also very functional. It's very easy to use. You just turn the dial, you have per park, reverse, neutral, drive, and sport mode. And this has an eight speed automatic transmission. So with eight four gears, that helps improve performance and improve gas mileage. Uh, the XF uh, uses lots of weight saving aluminum. Uh, it's not the cheapest way to build a vehicle. Uh, it costs more money, but this is a luxury brand. Um, so by using extensive uh, aluminum in the construction rather than heavier steel, it makes it a lot lighter. So that greatly improves uh, handling and performance as well as fuel efficiency uh, it gets gas mileage and uh, it feels or is uh, as light as uh, vehicles that are smaller so a lot of the competition um, it can uh, offer quite quite the uh, compelling reason to get this one when you get behind the wheel when you notice how light on its feet it is and how great it is on gas uh, this is the all-wheel drive model, so it doesn't get quite as good as gas mileage as the rear-wheel drive, but the all-wheel drive will really improve your wet weather performance. And if you do drive in the snow, you're going to do a lot better with all-wheel drive versus rear-wheel drive. So 20 city, 28 miles per gallon highway. Pretty impressive thinking uh, this also makes 340 horsepower from its supercharged V6. So it's very fast, but it's also very fuel efficient. And you can see we have the original build sheet on this one. Uh, when this was brand new, I had an original MSRP of $61,820, not a very cheap vehicle by any means. Uh, but luckily, on the pre-owned market, you're not going to pay anywhere near that. Uh, this is Rhodium Silver Metallic. That was a $550 premium. Also has a heated windshield. That was a $375 premium. And it's hard to see, you can't really see in the video, but you can see little teeny heating elements in the windshield. Doesn't obstruct your view. Uh, but it will really come in handy on those cold, cold days when your window starts icing up. 19-inch um, uh, Razor alloy wheels, in-touch control navigation, oyster leather with oyster uh, tonal stitching. Um, so those are some of the big ticket features. And of course, if you want a copy, we can email you one or print you one up when you come in. Beautiful black piano finish, electronic parking brake. Uh, you have a drive mode selector. Uh, that can make changes to uh, steering and traction control settings, uh, throttle response, uh, transmission shift points, uh, heated seats, really easy to use infotainment system, uh, rear parking camera, uh, moonroof, and then we have a power sunshade if it gets too bright out there for you, automatic dimming mirror of universal garage door opener, steering wheel paddle shifters, we also have a heated steering wheel, and only 17,023 miles, very low mileage for a 2017. Uh, most people average 10, 12, 15,000 miles a year, so exceptionally low miles. This is also a uh, local one owner clean Carfax vehicle. It's in beautiful shape inside and out. We also have a complimentary Carfax report. Uh, really looks good in silver. Silver is just such an easy color to take care of. It's kind of like the Goldilocks color, not too, light and not too dark surface imperfection scratches aren't going to show up quite as much in a car color like this versus black where kind of everything seems to show and being a mid-size uh, sedan interior space is very generous in the front and back i'm six foot two 
And while there's some compact vehicles where I'd sit in the back seat and I'd be very uncomfortable, um, I am, oh, very, un yeah, very uncomfortable. Um, the opposite, I'm very comfortable uh, back here in this Jaguar XF. One thing uh, people can never accuse a Jaguar of is making ugly cars. Uh, it's absolutely not the case. I don't think I've heard anyone criticize the way the Jaguar XF looks. Um, <laughs> well, I've heard many other criticisms about a lot of other cars. Uh, pretty much the jury is out. It is one drop dead gorgeous design, especially the front end styling. It, you know, suiting the, uh, the Jaguar name, it almost has a cat-like look to it. And I think it was, uh, it had a pretty significant facelift in either the 2016 or 2017 model year. There's that fantastic 340 horsepower twin, uh, not twin turbo, it's supercharged V6. Um, it sounds really nice too. Uh, effortless power, lots of fun to drive and complete luxury comfort. These are pretty rare, uh, all-wheel drive, prestige, 2017 Jaguar XFs. There's not too many for sale on the West Coast. I think according to our market software, which we use to price our vehicles and to see what is out there for uh, other car dealerships, what they have them priced and advertise that, we could only find, uh, I think, maybe one other one. So maybe if you're in a different part of the country and you're having a hard time finding one and you really like this one, worry not. We have a very big pre-owned business. We sell. Uh, used cars uh, uh, all over the country every month. Uh, we ship cars all the time. Uh, it's not that hard. We can give you a, a shipping quote and uh, we can help you get the vehicle registered and licensed in the state you live. And uh, in most cases, just as long as you don't have a residence here in Washington, you're going to pay sales tax, if applicable, where you live, not in Washington. And please contact us for more details about that. Thank you so much for taking the time today to watch this video. Hopefully we see you soon and have a wonderful day.